Evie, you know, League of Super Pets talks about crypto. Now, I grew up in the 40s and the 50s. Superman comics were the hot comics. We all knew who crypto was, and I just did a radio interview. They didn't know crypto. That's Superman's dog. Wake up, buddy. It is walk o'clock. And I'm up. Okay, Crypto. We'll go for a walk. So what happens is uh, the dog, Crypto, loses his powers and Superman is taken and it's left to these, you know, rambunctious pets that are all at the rescue to try to save, you know, Superman and all the DC uh, characters. And so these dogs and pets are saving them. This is them. cute. It's cute. I'm waiting for my dogs and pets to save me by getting rid of the rats on my property. You which... know, my dogs and pets are too friendly they just love on the villain this is a very funny villain i couldn't believe it the villain's name is lulu and she's a guinea pig that's got superpowers thanks to lex luther i cannot imagine an evil guinea pig <laughs> i don't know where they come up with this stuff but it's cute and there's some good themes in there but unfortunately there's some things that we need to be aware of yes yeah, so go to movieguide.org to find out the complete review of DC, the League of Super Pets. Batman works alone, except for Robin and Alfred, Commissioner Gordon, my IT crew, whoever Morgan Freeman played. 